News at 10. Most people don't know what a GMO is, and so that's why we're here to, not to scare people, but to inform them. Protesters march at the Capitol to take a stand against a major agriculture company. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Laura Wilson. Today's protesters spoke out against a hot topic in the ag world. Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Lauren Robinson joins us now with tonight's top story. That's right, Laura. Genetically modified organisms, or GMOs, definitely a global hot topic right now, which is why today a worldwide rally was held in opposition to GMOs. And locally, some ralliers here gathered at the state capitol with signs and chants. Just say no, GMO. Called the March Against Monsanto, 400 cities across the world participated today, according to one rallier who says companies like Monsanto, who add GMOs to their crops, are slowly killing the people who eat them. They are committing mass genocide um, by um, sneaking their genetically modified organisms into our food uh, without our consent. She adds that GMOs in the food supply is what has made the difference in hers and her kids' health. I have a seven-year-old daughter, and she was not organic um, and had tons of health issues. Um, and so because of that, I researched and researched and researched. And with him, it's been completely different. Uh, no medications, no GMOs, um, as much organic as possible, and his health is phenomenal. Another rallier says the point of this protest is to gain labels on all food. At least label, so then it gives the consumer the choice. I reached out to Monsanto and they said their food is scientifically proven to be completely safe and released this statement. We're proud of the work we do and we're eager for people to know more about us. We're also proud of our collaboration with farmers and partnering organizations that help make a more balanced meal accessible for everyone. Our goal is to help farmers do this in a more sustainable way, using fewer resources and having a smaller impact on the environment. Now, Monsanto also said they realize people have opposing positions as to what the company does, and they want to welcome all expressions of all points of view. All right, thank you very much, Lauren. 